Thousands of renewable energy leaders have gathered in Abu Dhabi for the sixth annual World Future Energy Summit. The three-day event kicked off with the French president calling for more investment in sustainable energy. Last year, investment from traditional green players like the U.S., Germany, Spain and Italy dropped, a figure offset by new investment from China. Roy Weinberg has more from Abu Dhabi. The time is now. A message of hope from one generation to another, that the world's energy can sustain not just those here, but those who will follow. And so began an international summit on the future of energy, perhaps appropriately in the country that has 10% of the world's oil reserves. The UAE has been providing energy for half a century. In line with our commitment as active member of the international community, we work to ensure security and achieve sustainable development. Among the opening speakers, the French president, François Hollande, who called for global cooperation and, without it, warned of the dire consequences. If we don't act, if we don't do anything, don't invest anything, we will have a catastrophe soon. The numbers are talking by themselves. Energy demand is growing and will grow more and more. But energy waste doesn't have to grow with it, argued his Argentinian counterpart. America. South America and the Caribbean are only responsible for 5 percent of emissions, but they have grown economically and have reached a social level that is important in a surprising way. And this will allow millions of people to have a better life. According to World Bank figures, one in five people in the world have no access to electricity. Another one billion have unreliable access, which officials say impedes growth and disproportionately hurts the world's poorest. The base of the development is energy. It's why it's very important uh, for African country, and especially my country, Djibouti, to come here to, uh, to discuss about the development. Based on the number of people in attendance, the highest in the summit's six years, organizers say the commitment is clear. The real question, however, is will the people here be able to deliver? Rui Rattenberg, CCTV in Abu Dhabi, UAE.